All right, all right. Sean Bunton here, and uh, I'm out here in the uh, new shop at the uh, uh, at Smith Lake here at our new home in Coleman, Alabama. And so I uh, just finally got the floors kind of uh, done up a little bit. You can see the uh, I've got them epoxied and uh, polyurethane put on top. Nice clear coat, nice clean surface to you know to work around the boat and um, you know just keep everything clean. So anyway. So the new Phoenix, man, I'm in love with this. I'm going to turn the camera for a minute, and I want to show you all some things. And I want to talk to you about a new product that I really got wind of through one of my uh, teammates on the Crusher, Crusher Lures out of Clanton, Alabama, um, Mr. Cliff Crochet. You've probably heard about the Cajun Baby, uh, my brother from another mother from South Louisiana. So I saw him uh, doing a little ad for this uh, new product and I'm gonna share that with you in a minute, but I'm, here's, here's why I'm considering the new product. So number one is the new Phoenix boat, right? Uh, and so I'm, let, let me just go ahead and jump right into what this product is and then I'll tell you why it's so important to me. All right, so this is Angler Armor with the catchphrase, no pun intended, hook a crook, okay? All right, so there, there's the new product. I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna get to the contents in this box in a minute, but why? Why Angler Armor? So what it is, is a boat alarm security system. And like I said, I'm gonna go into some of the, I'm not, this is not gonna be the how to install the Angler Armor. The, they've done a great job on their website. Uh, they provide documentation step by step. You don't need another install video, but I'm just going to share with you why um, I chose to go with this. So I've got uh, a Humminbird Helix 12 um, up at the bow. I've got a Garmin 1022 with pan optics. I've got a, 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 a Minn Kota Ultrex. I've got the uh, Humminbird Mega 360. You know. Um, here at the console, I've got two Helix 12s, you know. Um, in the back, you know, I've got uh, some Minn Kota Raptor, you know, shallow water anchors. Uh, got the, the 250 Pro XS four stroke. You know, and, and in my battery compartment, I've, I've got a pretty elaborate uh, system. You know, uh, I've got, got quite a bit of uh, financial investment in my, um, my trolling batteries and my, my batteries for my graphs. Uh, you know, as most of you know, this stuff is not uh, cheap and they don't give it away. So, you know, having a secure system is, is very important to me. So, you know, these lids lock, um, you know, they're, they're not going to defeat, you know, a crowbar or a, a you know, a, um, a pry bar of any kind. But they do give you some, you know, some uh, peace of mind to some degree, but, <clears throat> you know, not, not much. Uh, you know, I put my cover on the boat, you know, when I'm traveling too. And, uh, you know, that's a false sense of security. You know, I do keep the, uh, the Dura locks on all my graphs. You know, that's not gonna stop a thief from getting them if they really want them, but it might deter them long enough to maybe find another you know, victim. Uh, got them on the uh, on the graphs up front. Um, I've even got the Dura Lock on my uh, Minn Kota uh, Altrex here, and I even just purchased the Dura Lock for my spare tire as well. So, anyway, all of this on the Phoenix Bass boat, the boat itself, the trailer, the investment that I have in my fishing machine and my platform for which I go out and uh, and perform um, or try to perform in, in these bass tournaments all over the country. This, this is a big investment, y'all. You know it is. You know, and I want to, you know, and there's no system, I don't think, that is 100% flawless. So there's always going to be some drawbacks to everything. So, but anyway, I'm about to start installing the new Angler Armor Hook a Crook Alarm Security System. And so here we go. Okay, so I've got the, uh, the box opened up Angler Armor Hook a Crook 
digital boat alarm system. Now, a couple of things that I really liked when Cliff was uh, talking about this on a YouTube channel um, was the fact that it not only uh, can detect intrusion on up to five lockers, and I think uh, I, I spoke with the owner of Angler Armor, and I think there's a, there may even be a way to uh, integrate additional um, sensors, uh, you know, if you have more than five lids for instance because on this phoenix 921 elite 2 i've got four lids you know up here on the bow now one of them I, i'd keep some you know shirts and my life vest in nothing really of any significant value and then you know my this back locker i usually have uh reserved for co-anglers um so they come and go and their belongings come and go but you know i keep tackling the other side I mentioned my my battery compartment, you know. So I've got I've got more than five areas that I could potentially use, uh, you know, um, uh, maybe an extra sensor, you know, for um, for this system. So anyway, that's 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 to come. But but uh, aside from sensing intrusion into the lockers for which you put the sensor in. Um, this thing has an, <clears throat> an app uh, that helps uh, you communicate with the system itself and it also gives you alarms, proximity alarms, uh, I believe, and I'll demonstrate that maybe at some point in the future and, and show you a little bit about the app and how, I've, how I use it. But uh, from my understanding, if the boat moves outside of a proximity, of where I set it. In other words, if somebody tries to hook up to my boat and drive off with it, this thing will send me GPS coordinates of where my boat is and it can detect acceleration, right? So if you open the lid and I have this stuck underneath the lid, this device will experience some uh, force of acceleration, even though it's kind of maybe maybe small, it's still gonna, uh, gonna sense that. It's gonna sense that, um, that acceleration when you open the lid and it's going to communicate with the brain and say hey intruder alert and a siren's going to an audible siren will will alarm so anyway what comes in the box the cpu and five sensors accelerometers whatever you want to call them so okay now i'm going to put it together all right so had to pick it up uh, the next day i just got too tired yesterday on uh, on the <clears throat> Had a lot of other chores to do too, but uh took me about 45 minutes to install this thing. Um, the new Angler Armor uh, Hook a Crook Boat Security System came with, remember it came with five uh, accelerometer sensors that you can place uh, at your discretion on uh, important lockers that hold, um, you know, the, the more expensive things uh, in your boat, like your rods and your tackle and uh, your spare prop and, and so forth. So anyway, um here's the app and i'm gonna just zoom in a little bit it's kind of hard to see it i know but anyway i've got the system armed so let's let's just give it a test real quick so let me open up the back locker there we go there we go got a notification so i got a notification and uh you can boy that uh that alarm, it's, it's got to be close to 100 decibel. I'm not sure exactly what the dB rating is on it. Um, you know, I didn't, I didn't put an accelerometer, uh, a sensor uh, on this locker um, because uh, I don't ever keep anything in there. You know, I keep it in, uh, I keep that one empty for co-anglers and so forth. So I don't know, here, here's another one. I've got the sensors in here. Boom, there it is. Should get a notification. Let's see. So turn that off. I didn't see a notification come through that time, but but anyway, um, you know, let me uh, let me go. Let me shut this locker again. Let me open my rod locker up here. Get my jigs and my shaky worm out of the way. Let's see. 
Oh, look. Let's see what happened. Oh, there's the notification. Anger, uh, angler armor locker event, locker open. So, looks like everything is working properly. Let me just show you where the, uh, let me turn it off here. It's kind of loud. Whew. There we go. There we go. She's armed. <clears throat> um, I put the sensor right there. You can see it under the locker lid right there. Um, I actually put the other sensor here and the other one there. So my, my battery compartment, uh, my main uh, tackle storage, my uh, rod storage, my accessories, extra life vest, electronics, spare parts for the trolling motor, stuff that's you know kind of expensive. Uh, this locker too, I don't I don't ever really keep anything of real significant value in there. It's kind of my my storage place for my rain jacket. You know, if I want to take it off or a sweatshirt when it gets hot, you know, um, <clears throat> might take it off and shove it in there. So nothing nothing really big there. <clears throat> um, I think I can add two more accessory uh, sensors to my system and cover the uh, other rod lockers just for the sake of. Uh, of doing it another really cool thing that this uh, allows you to do is you can connect up shore power which is basically just a you know when you're charging your battery system it's going to go off here let me let me open it up again hey, watch out. got you hook the truck <laughs> Anyway, whoo, that thing is loud with the door open now. So, uh, so anyway, um, <clears throat> you can connect up this to a uh, to the same extension cord that you're charging your your boat system in the evening. So you can plug that into the same extension cord, and if for some reason that power is detected being lost here, then it alerts the the uh, angler alarm system so no more of those gfci's uh trips late at night and you wake up and your boat's only 50 or 60 percent charged this thing will send you a notification to your phone that hey guess what your battery charger uh has been disconnected from the system and uh, that's a really cool feature because uh, we don't want to wake up and only have 50% battery juice, right? So anyway, I've got the siren mounted here. I've got the CPU mounted. This is a uh, 2022 Phoenix 921 Elite 2. <clears throat> it's a, a um, just just got it not long ago, but <clears throat> excuse me, decided to mount the sensor. I mean the siren here, the CPU here, and you can see here's the. Uh, Here's the sensor, the accelerometer that detects the uh, actual opening of the lid. So not only does it make an audible alarm and send me a notification to my phone if one of these rod lockers are tampered with or intrusion uh, is, is attempted, I can also click on the locate button and it will tell me where my boat is. So if someone gets a wild hair and wants to rip my boat off, you know, um, it actually will will detect where my boat is. There's a GPS um, system integrated into this uh, alarm system, and it's really nice. So, man, uh, uh, Brian Fox, uh, uh, you know, uh, the uh, I think Brian is the it, it's this is his product. Uh, he may have partnered with, uh, you know, the folks that make the app. I'm not sure about their relationship. He was really, really, the customer service was second to none. I asked some questions off of the website, and he was kind enough to respond right away and, and just wrote a dissertation about, uh, you know, the, his customer service and, and answering the technical questions that I had about his product. And so I was really happy about that. And then, you know, a few days went by and I didn't make my purchase like uh, I told him I was going to do. And he followed up again and said, hey, you know, I'm not, not bugging you or anything, but the, if you got any more questions, you know, please feel free to reach out to me and holler at me. So then, you know, when I started installing the system, um, I had a few questions and uh you know i sent him a text and said hey i got some questions would you mind you know hollering back at me and man within like 20 minutes he called me said and we talked for like 30 minutes so great product angler armor hook a crook boat system and so there it is 45 minutes i had it installed integrated with my phone's uh wireless network 
and the application uh, can keep track of uh, you know the security of my boat with a lot of cool features so again let me just run through them uh, audible alarm you heard it it's kind of deafening really if you're up here close to it uh, could definitely hear it across the street here at my house in Coleman um, it also has uh, you know the sensors of five comes with five sensors for your rod lockers I think you can purchase an extra two uh, you know, uh, auxiliary sensors for other lids if you wanted to. It's got the shore power, so if you if you connect a a three way to the end of your extension cord and then plug your ba your boat's battery chargers into that, if that charger, if that extension cord loses power throughout the night, uh, it, this uh, senses that the power is lost and it will send a notification to your phone saying, hey, hey, dude, you're not charging. And then of course the other really cool feature is the GPS locator. So no matter where my boat is if I'm separated from it um, it'll give me an update about once a minute I think on the boat's position so it might help me uh, lead me or the police you know to uh, to where my boat is so anyway uh, not sponsored by uh, angler armor in, in any shape or form just uh, just a fan of the product it was a really great easy install I really like it so far and I uh, can't wait to uh, you know add this security system to when I travel around the country fishing so tight lines bass and button uh, see you on the water